Hello everyone, welcome back to ETS2. So today guys, we're going to be using, and I did it already, we're going to be using John Ruta's, um freight loader, um, I wish, come on, quit doing that. His Freightliner Classic over here. Gotta fix the map. I'm about to reroute the button. Um, his Freightliner Classic does work in, in ATS and ETS too. He has support for both. This is the flat top version of his uh, Freightliner Classic. Ready to roll. Trucks found a uh, Detroit diesel. <laughs> With 18 speed eating full of transmission, we'll go ahead and close the map up so we can get on the road. Got our little Coca-Cola there, shifter. Good looking truck. Hope everyone's doing well. We want to get in here and do uh, some videos with some of his trucks. I did one over on ET on ATS of the W900, and I'm going to have to do another one. It was dark when that one started, so. Turn right. But hats off to Mr. Root. Now, I always tell you, like I said over there, these are paid mods. You do have to pay for them. They're not free. And. I had heard a lot about his trucks and trailers, and so I decided to check his trucks out. Turn left, and then continue straight on. I don't play ETS as much, yeah, so... On. We got 352 miles to go. I'm unsure we're gonna have to get on the ferry. I don't think we will. Let me take a look. Take a look at the map and see here. Okay, we will have to get on the ferry. So that uh, that's gonna take a lot of our trip. That's okay. So that being the case, I'm gonna go ahead and I think go ahead and get a thumbnail. Go ahead and get that out of the way. And I hope everyone's like I said is doing well. Hope you're enjoying the videos. I really been enjoy getting here doing more content. This is something that I I want to do more and more and more. Um, I'm loving the. The comments, I'm loving everything, what everybody's saying uh, you know, about the channel. So thank you for everyone that's been watching. And also, don't forget to look at check out the second channel. Um, but yeah, guys, look at this uh, this great looking truck. Uh, like I said, this is the flat top version. It's a good looking truck. Hats off to John Ritter. Now, if you want these trucks, you go to his website. I don't link my stuff, guys, uh, but you go over to his website and he will send you information for payment. And once he sends you information for payment, he receives his payment. He will uh, send you all the download links uh, the, for his trailer pack. He also has uh, ETS2 trucks. Um, I prefer this over ETS2 trucks. Just to be honest with you, I could drive this all the time over here. Um, Viper's truck doesn't work over here no more. It hasn't been updated in a while, so as long as I'm having a good mod like this to drive over here, I'm happy. You know, um, but he will send you the link to everything through an email and you just download it and, and he will also give you instructions of photos on how to install it to make it work um, 
that is something a lot of uh, questions come back by in installing his trucks his trucks they have to be installed a certain way to make them work not every one of them has to be done but uh, this one and the uh, Peterbilt does and so Get ready you have to make sure that you install it the right way Turn left. And yeah, you know, and I'm going to say this: there is uh, some good free mods out there too, guys. So don't don't think that you got to pay for your mods. You don't. And normally I don't, but I wanted to check out these trucks, and they are awesome. All right, so we're going to get on the ferry. Rerouting. Never mind. I'll find a new route. That would have been the quickest ferry ride I've ever seen. Get ready to turn left. Turn left. So we are um, testing, looking at some of his stuff, um, definitely get the trucks that I will uh, try to keep in, um, updated a lot. Um, I do not have the MHA Pro Map over here. I want to get the MHA That's Pro the Map over map. here. Um, now, I do believe that the free version of the MHA Pro Map is not supportive anymore. I will find that out to, to see if it is supported. Exit now. But I'm, from what I'm seeing, it has not been supported for a while. Um, the paid version is not much. It's like six bucks. It gives you a lot of stuff, a lot of extra add-ons. I'm unaware of everything it does give you for ETS 2. I don't play ETS 2 as much as I do ATS, so I'm not sure of everything else it does give you. But it does give you a quite a bit extra for six six dollars. So. It is a great addition to have. At the roundabout, take the second exit. For this game. Exit now. Kind of being quiet. We'll roll the window down a little bit. Let you hear the sound of this uh, Freightliner, that Detroit Diesel. Guys, I've had to uh, request to do some mod installment uh, videos to let you know how to uh, do mods. Uh, mods for ATS and ETS2 uh, are very simple. They're very simple to install. They're very simple, you know, to, to find. 
uh, a lot of your mods are found on the Steam Workshop for these games, so... <laughs> Sorry about that. A lot of these mods are found on the Steam Workshop. Uh, they're very simple to install. Um, the ones that's not over there. Keep right. Look, see how many miles we got left. Oh, we got 94 miles to go. Go straight on. Uh, and a lot of things, guys, is I, I and I will agree with Mr. Jeff Fabiano. On the beta society for games, uh, there hasn't really been a lot announced. Uh, it's coming out right now that I can really say I'm excited for. Um, I would have to say right now the biggest thing that I'm excited to see is I would have, would have to say would be Wyoming and Texas for my truck somewhere. Um, you know the 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 virus has slowed down games coming out. It it, it really has. It, it's um. You're not really seeing what we were seeing like two years ago in the, in the market for games. Uh, obviously, you know, we, we do have Battlefield coming out this year. You do have Call of Duty. Those games come out every year. Um, Call of Duty does. So, yes, that is coming. But, you know, I just had to say the biggest one so far that I played that I enjoyed was the Mass Effect Trilogy. So, but as, you know, as of now, I mean, there, there's just there's nothing out there. There's nothing really coming out. That, that I can really say I'm excited for, except for Wyoming. Straight on. Take a little outside view of the truck here if I can get it to work. No, it's not going to work. Something's going on. I'm going to have to redo my buttons to make that work. The re, re key bind them. Go straight on. There it goes. Can't really sit that good at night, but that's okay.
just kind of being quiet for a minute here. Enjoying the drive. I need to turn that off, I know. He's like, dim your lights. That's the little notification that you're speeding. It's what that noise is, guys. It gives you a little notification, so hey, you know, you're going too fast. You didn't, you didn't, you know, you need, you need to slow down. I need to turn it off. Please wait while checking your documents. Checking your documents. Please wait. Alright, we're ready to go. We're going to turn that off right now. I'm, it's done again aggravated me enough let's see what is it under there he won't do that no more Well, I thought it wouldn't do that now. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Okay, it says we went the wrong way. Hmm. We'll just cross over this media right here. Turn left. Finding a new route. We normally don't do that, but I don't know why it sent us through here. Okay, there's a, a, a border, I guess you could say here. I thought it turned that off. I'll have to look at that again. Checking your documents, please wait.
good sign of Detroit Diesel. Everyone is in order. Have a good, a nice Let's journey. Go. Turn right. Turn right. So we're just about to start to drop down here. Kind of looking around here. Turn right. So hey, fool, dim your lights. We said no. <coughs> they blind you. doing that it should go to, to that Let's see if we can uh, get it in here. These European trailers are a little bit different to back than American trailers. They do turn better though. Alright, we drove 151 miles, got excellent, took us 15 hours and 14 minutes to get here, we consumed 20.7 gallons of fuel.
gonna take some cameras, some D DSLR cameras. Alright guys, that's going to be it. We're going to wrap it up here for this video over, over here on ETS2. I'm going to get in here and show off John Ruda's uh, Freightliner. Um, the classic. I do have his, his fit of uh, the, the cab over. I can't talk today for some reason. The cab over the uh, 362. It does not work here in ETS2. It works on, on ATS. So I will be making a video of that also. So thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And have a good day. What am I doing?